Welcome back, y'all. Um, I was going to do a review. I was thinking about doing a review for Basketball Wives Season 6, Episode 1, and try to review the whole season. Um, but I didn't take notes because I didn't know if I should. So just let me know in the comments. Um, but I'm about to try to review it real quick. Um, it's going to be real short because, I, like I said, I did not make no notes. And I can't really remember the episode. I watched it yesterday. But I remember some of the key points. So I'm about to just try to review it real fast. So basically this season has been hyped up for weeks and weeks and weeks by Shawnee and by the network VH1. They're just trying to promote the fact that Evelyn is back and Tammy is still there and they don't get along. And they're two big dogs that don't get along and it's like the big, it's like the main event. Like you want to see them fight. But I don't think they fight this whole season. And to be honest, they both too old to fight. And they kind of similar when you think about it because they both don't take no mess. They both pretty hard and um, they both are trying to have a baby, right? Because on this episode, it seemed like Evelyn had mentioned that she was trying to have another baby. And we all know what's going on with Tammy. And they both keep having miscarriages. So they're kind of similar in that aspect. But... Basically, Evelyn meets up with Shawnee. Shawnee talks about, um, basically, Tammy's here, and she's like, "Was what, y'all don't get along? Evelyn's like, no. Then we see Evelyn. She tells about um, Tammy the same thing. Basically, this episode is centered around Shawnee throwing a 70s party. Um, and I think one of them said, we 70s babies, and I'm like, oh, uh, <laughs> they all 70s babies? Because, um. I don't know. Some of these girls seem like they might be 60s babies. But anyway, that's nonetheless. Um, Jackie, what's going on with her and her life is that she, her daughter, is pregnant. You know, the one that she likes. The one that she likes. Is having a baby. I think her name is Shani. The baby, her daughter name is Shani. I'm not too sure, though. Um, Joss, or Jackie moved from some state to some other city or state because Doug got a job and you know she followed him but now she's back in LA and um uh she's excited to be a grandma and she wants to be involved in her daughter's her grandchild's life as much as possible um she's mad she her deal with Evelyn is that she's mad because Evelyn donated $3,500 I think it was $3,500 to her other daughter, the one that she has problems with and everyone thinks she doesn't like. She thinks that she was getting involved and that it was rumored that she thought, that Evelyn thought that Jackie was an unfit grandma and didn't help with her daughter. I think this whole thing was stupid. Like, Jackie, if you didn't hear Evelyn say all that, then you shouldn't even be mad. You should not be mad at all. You should have been tried to see if she thought, felt that way about you. And Jackie, if she donated the thirty five hundred, oh well, what the heck? That's why your daughter put put the GoFundMe up was to get the money. And so what? Evelyn donated it. If you mad at Evelyn for donating, then you should be mad at every single person that donated. Why are you so mad? You should have donated. She's like, oh, she don't need help. Well, if she didn't need help, she wouldn't have put the to the um. The GoFundMe page up. And I know I'm jumping around because, like I said, I don't have notes. But basically, at the 70s party, Jackie had a good outfit, by the way. Good costume. I liked what well, Jackie. She was a pimp. And she was like, oh, this is my hoe. I didn't know who that was. But anyway, Jackie um said she went after Evelyn. And Evelyn was so calm sitting there like, oh, yeah, well, she, she basically said everything I just said. She shouldn't have put it up. She wanted people to donate. That's why I donated. And uh, Jackie basically... Uh, Jackie said, um, she has a mom that can do this, she has, she has this, well, it was stupid. Jackie had no reason to be mad at Evelyn, <laughs> and they, um, they make up, basically. Now, Tammy is mad at Evelyn. They mad at two different things. This don't make sense. I was so confused watching this. Evelyn is still stuck on what happened so long ago. This happened, I remember... I was, oh my god, I might have been a freshman in high school. Or even not in high school yet. But I remember binge watching Basketball Wives because I came across it on Netflix and I binge watched like three seasons. Evelyn is still mad because of the non 
the non motherfucking factor statement and how Tammy thinks that Evelyn was sleeping with her husband Kenny while they were married. Evelyn says, oh, they weren't married, or if they was, I didn't know. Something like that. You filed for divorce at this time. Evelyn, why are you still mad at that? Tammy got a way better issue. Tammy is mad because in interviews, Evelyn... This part didn't make sense either, though, now that I think about it. She says Evelyn disrespected her and talked bad and said she never wanted to be friends with her. At the party, Evelyn... They they went at it with their stories, and Shoney was like, no, y'all are talking about two different things. Tammy doesn't care about what Evelyn is saying. She says she is right, though, but she don't care about that. Evelyn is saying, no, you making me come off as a hoe. And Tammy's like, you're trying to convince people that you're not one. Excuse me. And she's like, uh, yeah, we know that you've been through three. Oh, then we see a dinner with Shawnee and Tammy. And Tammy says to Shawnee, that Evelyn been through three different sports, basically. Baseball, basketball, and football. Shawnee started laughing. I don't think that was her being fake. Because if something is funny, you're going to laugh. I do think it's fake, however, that Shawnee is talking about Evelyn with Tammy. And talking about Tammy with Evelyn. I think that's fake. You shouldn't do that. If You can be friends with both of them, but don't discuss. You know? And you telling what this person said and what that person said, that's fake. That's doing too much. Um, then we see... Oh, um, Tammy said, look, look at the interview. Listen to the interview. And Shawnee listened to it, and I'm like, what? At the party, Evelyn said, I never disrespected you in the interview. Tammy said, I have video of it. Tammy played the video, and Evelyn didn't disrespect. I'm kind of on Evelyn's side now. Tammy just blowing everything out of proportion because Evelyn said, I don't want to talk about her. I'm not going to. And then Tammy said, now didn't she say? And Shawnee was like, I think she said that, you know. Duh. And to be honest, I think Shawnee is more on Evelyn's side. I think Shawnee is probably a little bit more friends with Evelyn than Tammy. Or at least she wants to be more friends with Evelyn than Tammy. Remember Shawnee and... Tammy did have issues at one point. I don't think Shawnee and Evelyn ever had issues. I do wish Jennifer was back on this. Because I really liked her when I binge watched. And then she was off. And I know that there was rumors that she was getting brought back. And Evelyn made her not come. I, think, I don't like that. But that's it for this episode review. I know I missed a whole bunch of stuff. and Well, but basically, I don't even know if I missed nothing. That was the gist of the episode. That's what really happened. And that's my opinion. But depending on how this, um, how the reviews on this review go, the reviews on this review go. But <laughs> depending on how the reviews on this review go will determine if I keep going with this. or. Um, and by the way, the Empire Review... I was busy last Wednesday. I took notes on the episode, but I never got a chance to film it. And once it got to Friday and I didn't film it, I'm like, or even late in the day Thursday, I'm like, there's no point in filming. So I think Empire on a two-week break right now, so hopefully I will come back with the next review of Empire. And the other review, because I didn't review Empire for the past two episodes, the review from before that, I filmed it on my iPhone. And I couldn't upload it to YouTube for whatever reason. It just kept failing. So I deleted the video. It was it was like 30 minutes too because I, I did this thing where I watched some, then recorded, then watch, watched up until the first commercial break, then recorded a review. Watched up to the next commercial break, then recorded a review. I did like that. So, and it's a lot of shows coming on on Monday too. Like I watch WWE Raw. I watch Love and Hip Hop. Basketball wise, and now T.I. and Tiny, all three, like it's a lot of shows on Monday that I can't review. So if y'all watching any of those shows, let me know and I'll start reviewing them. But until next time, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and share this video.